Hey YouTube, I'm going to show you another uh, setup that I'm going to try to uh, run the scooter on hydrogen. So um, here I'll, I'll show you what I got. Got the same power supply, same cell, two bubblers. Now I'm using a um, quite a bit smaller hose this time. So um, as you can see the, the um, inside diameter of that one is uh, quite a bit smaller. Um, I'm putting this hose right down into the uh, top of the carburetor and then um, the uh, hydroxy gas is fed in right uh, right before the throttle plate. So I'm gonna try to see how this setup works. And again I got the, uh, the um, fuel line to the carb clamped off as you can see. Um, and I've also run it out of gas. So, a little bit here, I'll, sh I'll show you the test. Here that, the, uh, that the scooter won't start without the hydrogen, so I'll do that. Okay. I'm going to put my carrying protection on. And now we're gonna try the uh, try the test. Okay, we'll try to put more, turn up the gas. Okay. All right, we have it started. And um, I'm going to try blocking off the air. Okay, we have it running. I need to. Okay, we have it running. I'm gonna plug all the air coming in front of the um, front of the carb, so the only air that is coming in is coming through the uh, top of the carburetor. Okay, so I'm gonna try to. Uh, Turn the throttle a little bit. Okay, we got it to start up. I'm going to try to give it some more gas. Okay, we got the RPMs up a little bit. I'm going to try to... Okay, 
any touch of the throttle, it seems like it wants to die out. I'm, I have a theory that as you turn the throttle, that the um, timing may be changing. So, uh, that's a possibility. Let me see what happens if I put my finger over the pole. Okay, we'll show a, pick the camera here and I'll show you a closer view of this. So we have the hydroxy going into the top of the carburetor here. And then there's the line. There's the production. And the cell. So I have these two plugged off. So it's, all, it's only pulling its air from the top of the carb there. Now I'm going to see it, how far I can get the um, electrical input to go down and have it still run. Okay, let's see what we can do. Okay, that looks like that's about as uh, far as I could go down with the uh, gas input.